what do you bring? Your answers is not the table. The answers is not me. That's you, you're no the one. Is, I'm already a yeah. millionaire. I make this much money without you. Your work ethic? Are you ambitious? Are you? Late? You're not bringing anything to him. You're well, taking away from him. Yeah. Like help, help. I I don't need you to just come in here and just be another person. I don't want to treat you like a kid. If I'm just sitting here with a whole nother fucking pet, right? Yeah. Oh, I got to feed you, feed the dress you, this and that. And like, oh, we're going to the mall. <laughs> oh, I, I need a new Birkin. Oh, look, look, all right. yeah, shit, that, that Birkin, I could have got fucking 20 vaginas for that. <laughs> so, the way they sell it on Instagram, fucking a thousand a pop. <laughs> Yo, what's good guys? I'm back with a little Gilbert Arenas video. You already know Gilbert is one of the funniest men on the internet. So might as well, you know, react slash analyze a, a little video he made on Vlad TV's channel. It's basically Gilbert Arenas talking to Vlad about women and how uh, most women that they, that they attract or whatever the case may be. These are high maintenance women. They're gonna be asking for Birkins, Gucci, Prada, whatever designer that you can think of. These women will ask for it. If they know you got that bag, let's say if you're Instagram celebrity or Instagram influencer, whatever the case may be, Fashion Nova, Deals, you're an NBA player, you're an actor, whatever the case may be. If it's publicly known that you're a public figure and you got cash, bitches gonna be after you. And not the regular bitches, the, you know, Birkin bags, Gucci, you, go, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? So we're just gonna get into it, man. It's Gilbert and Vlad. I wanted to see what they have to say about the the, the matter. So we're just gonna get into that video, bro. You talked about how really as a celebrity, you don't really trust new friends. You don't trust women. Yeah, I feel you, man. I, it's, it's, I, I don't trust words. I trust ethics. Yeah. What's your work ethic? Are you ambitious? Are you late? Like, so I'm I'm judging you. Like, I don't care about your past. Like, you can, you can then fuck the whole world. What? How are you treating me? Like, what? You know how I said I, I would agree with certain statements that Gil would make on the internet. I don't agree with that. No skanks. Yes, your history matters. Man, if you've been around the block like 74 times, if you've been around the block like 75 to 76 times, I don't want that no more. It's like a used pair of shoes. Who, 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 who's gonna want like a used pair of Jordans that, that have been worn like 100 times, 30 times? You're used, you're cooked. It's over, bro. That's what I'm saying. Like, on this statement, I don't agree with Gilbert. We don't want no skank with, like, crazy history. Even if I have money, man, I mind you, I'm not, I'm not rich. But when I get rich, we ain't doing that. Bro, your clientele, boy. It's like a little, you know, man-to-man -man conversation. For the younger ones, the older ones, they might already know. I see my analytics. I got 18 to 24-year-olds in there. Know your clientele. Make the difference between love and lust. It's two different things, bro. It's two different things. And most, most of the time, these NBA players, these celebrities, they can't make the difference they think they love that girl in particular i try not to curse anymore you know i try to keep the cursing to a down low these nba players some of these niggas they don't even do the math on how to choose a proper woman gotta watch out who you associate yourself with especially if she's of the other sex a woman make sure you get a real woman not no no bop come on man come on man are you helping me build something right because technically for most dudes that have money, women are useless to them. That's low key a fact. I can't really speak on, on that perspective because I'm not like these dudes, you know what I'm saying? And I'm, I'm okay with that. I'm a regular dude. But at the end of the day, even a regular dude, bro, it's not even about the money like that. It's what about the man can bring you in terms of knowledge, in terms of what's going on around the world, economy, politics. Does this man know what's going on around the world? That's for the women. If your man, women, if your man don't know what's going on in any type of way, like let's say the, the financial situation around the world or the politics, like I said, the war, everything, even if he rich. When it's all said and done, when Yeshua comes back, he won't be able to help you. He won't be able to help you. Cause he ain't got that. Or this, or this. The trifecta, mind, soul, and the gut. You know, not a lot of men know that. It's not only the women that are sometimes clueless about what's important in life about what's important in life. It's not only the man, it's both of us. At the end of the day, I really wanted to laugh at that video, but 
I'm taking kind of a serious turn on, on the subject because these are real life issues, man. At the end of the day, men and women should unite to be fruitful and multiply. It's written in the Bible. Some of y'all that don't know. Yeah, I believe in him. He's here. He's coming back. So, man, next couple of years, man, y'all better make the good decisions, man. I'm just trying to help out as most people as I can. Barely get any any views here, but really, if, if I can help at least some of y'all, man, to realize what's going on. And really, this is a correlation to the vid, because we, we have to unite. And right now, the world is devised. That's just what I'm trying to say. You know what I'm saying? All the women off. right now need to pay attention to what but, we're saying. But they're it's gonna... It's not just the ass and titties. I, I can... It's I not... Can, yeah, and, and, I ass can buy and that. titties. They sell it. They sell it. Oh. They sell that. Again, I don't agree with every single statement, whatever the case may be with Gil. It's really... You could be really pulverizing if you look at him a certain type of way. But most of the time, if you put your little ego or your little thing you have to the side and just listen to what Gil has to say, take it for what it is, he's right. Bro, they sell y'all. Women need to understand too, bro. You know how easy, do you know how cheap it is to actually get some, some cuckoo? It's cheap, bro. So for women, what, like Gil said, what do you bring to the table? Fuck all that Birkin shit. Fuck all that, I'm an independent woman. Fuck all that, bro. If you're a man and you don't know what you bring to the table, you shouldn't have a woman by your side. You're not ready. We all have roles and our roles should not be mixed. You know how the propaganda is right now. Everything, everybody does everything. You know what I'm saying? It's kind of hard for some of these people to understand where I'm coming from. Literally, the world was made so that man and women can coexist together to bring life and fruitfulness but for that to be able to happen we have to know our role bro i'm not gonna get into the details you see the propaganda you see the agendas you see the brainwashing that's all to divide us as men and women so that women can be men and men can be women but i'm not gonna say much there's a window with a woman there. You go in, they close the curtain, the bed is right there. You do your business, you leave. That is it. They sell it. It's, it's, a, it's a transaction. They sell it on Instagram too. They sell it. <laughs> oh, that's kind of crazy. I've been rambling for a, a, a quick minute, but I think I'm going to end it here. I honestly thought that video was, was, was going to be a bit more light hearted, funny, but it, it really just made me think about serious matters that are affecting our society day in and day out and at the end of the day i'm not gonna sit here and cap and tell you shit it is funny if i don't find it funny i'm gonna tell you how i see it man and with the research i did and the things i know we better stay locked in for what's coming in man we better stay locked in because at the end of the day like i said uh, i have no problem with gilbert but saying that you could get 20 vaginas at the price of a birkin is not even something to be proud of if you think about it every every woman wants to be a bad bitch and every nigga wants to be a pimp, man. Come on, man. Who's your boy Low Key Reacts? And I'm out.